with your work in comics, uh, you became interested in Jack Chick. You appeared in the documentary God's Cartoonist to talk yes. about. For those who haven't seen them, these are small uh, comic books which are usually handed to you at airports or, or left... Uh, yeah, air, really? Well, they're left in bus stations or some place where people may find them and be saved. Since Chick, a fundamentalist Christian, really believes that most people are going to hell and they just need to read a Chick tract or two and that will set them on the right path. And uh, actually, people do find them and people are convinced by them, particularly if you read a lot of them by the end of the evening, you'll start to think maybe you should get down on your knees and kowtow to Jesus and maybe avoid the fiery pit. Chick is an underground cartoonist. He is. He is he's, uh, he's the most published underground cartoonist of all time. And he's, how can he not be since his work sells for 14 cents or whatever it is, unlike like other comic books, of, uh, which are copy. more expensive. And today, a few people buy comic books because they don't flash or blink or have ads in the margins or, or whatever. Uh -huh. uh, but uh, now the uh, the more ordained uh, conspiracy type comic books are being mined as a basis for enormous and heavily profitable movies. And that oh, actually, yes. now that uh, tale is wagging the comic book dog. It wouldn't oh, have yes. existence without that. I really think that like uh, in Hollywood, they, they view comic books as prefab storyboards. Yes. And they are. That's a beautiful way to produce storyboards. Uh, comic books are telling, uh, comic strips tell stories in sequential form. Mm -hmm. And uh, they must set up the views in order to convey the information. Mm -hmm. uh, storyboards resemble comic books. There was one I read, um, A Little Princess. Oh, yes. Uh, where the, the girl is dying of cancer and... That maudlin yeah. note often uh, comes into them. They, it yeah, gets they worse than that, actually, uh, as far as the, the bathos is concerned. But nothing is uh, beyond the chicks. Uh, uh, and, and she goes out, her last wish is like trick-or-treat, and there's the evangelist next door, and they, and they witness for her. What? You say there's a Jehovah's Witness who won't give his child a blood transmission? I'll, I'll send Bob right over, and he'll, uh, he'll argue that, you know... Uh -huh. Uh, what? You say they're teaching evolution in this school? Uh, we'll send or a guy over. Actually, Chick gets out of control and the, the prose gets more and more on the pages and the comics diminish more and more until finally there are a few drawings of heads and a huge ream of anti-Catholic diatribe or anti-Muslim, anti-Buddhist, anti-Jehovah's anti Witness, uh, uh, whatever, anti-everything.